Hello, this is Coach Ease Pierce, and I'm coming back at you for romantic advice for men. Now, before I actually highlight my topic, I want to remind you, if you haven't done so already, I want you to hit that subscribe button, and if you like this video, to please give me a thumbs up. Now, the, the issue, your woman left you for another man. Should you take her back? Well, it all depends. I always tell my male clients that you got to take a look in the mirror and check out your reflection and be honest. Do you like what you see? Meaning, were you controlling? Now, what most often pushes a woman away is a man who is very controlling. For instance, are you someone who is always having an issue with your significant other going out with her friends, her family, or her co-workers? Let's say that her co-workers, they have this ritual. Like every Friday, they'll get together after work and they'll hang out for two hours and that's it. And now all of a sudden, okay, you come along and you find that to be an issue, but you are controlling due to the fact that you keep bringing it up and you're always bombarding her with questions, why, why, why every Friday. You need to let your woman have space. Number two, another major issue is trust. I always tell my male clients that if you are someone who's not able to trust your woman, you should not be in a relationship. For example, you're asking her like, where are you going with your female co-workers? What are you doing with your female co-workers? So on and so forth. That shows a lack of trust and it will push her away. And lastly, the third, the third point that I want to bring out is overbearing. Are you someone who is just very overwhelming regarding reading her text messages. Now, I understand that there should be trust in a relationship and she should, you know, read your text messages or vice versa, you know, particularly if you guys have a bond. But if you are always checking out her phone and reading her text messages, that's a sign that it's overbearing or she goes out with her, her family or, you know, her friends to an event and you're trying to shame her, like, why are you doing that? You should be hanging out with me. That's a no-no. And I always tell my male clients that if you come across as someone who is just over the top in terms of just being overbearing, you are going to push that woman away. Now, if you fall into any of these categories that I highlighted, you push that woman away. And if she's coming back to you, you wanna show her that you have changed. And you do that by making sure that you see a therapist. Now, I'm gonna flip the, flip the coin. Let's just say that you were not controlling and you were very trusting and you were the complete opposite of overbearing. So if that's the case, and she thought that the grass was greener, I would say to you, no, do not take her back because she took you for granted. You heard it from me, Coach Ease Pearson. If you like this video, I want you to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button. Thank you.